All right, with sophomore catcher Brian O'Keefe, two hits, three runs batted in, and the Hawks' 8-4 win over St. Bonaventure on Friday. Brian, the reigning Big Five Player of the Week, swinging the bat pretty well. What's been going right for you up there? You know, uh, my teammates are uh, seeing a lot of pitches for me. They're helping me out, getting a lot of information for myself. And, you know, I'm just in one of those grooves right now, and uh, it just seems like everything they throw up there, I'm hitting. Now you guys today are facing a conference opponent that you're familiar with, but in a non-conference series. How, how much do you think that familiarity either helps or hurts you guys during a game like this? I mean, we definitely got to approach it as if it was a conference game. And, you know, we played them last year, took two or three from them. And, you know, I think this year's the same approach to win the series no matter what, whether we're playing, a comp whether we're playing them in conference or out of conference. All right, we're here with head coach Fritz Hamburg. Coach Hawks with an 8-4 win today. Kind of a strange game, a little bit of a uh, hitter's paradise early on, and then the pitchers settled in. Uh, walk us through kind of how the game went today. Yeah, it was kind of an odd game, I think, from both sides. Uh, Kyle struggled early to find his rhythm, and uh, you know he did a good job towards the back end. His last three innings, he, he kind of picked up, picked up the pace. But their kid did a good job of throwing his change up and uh, kept us on the balance. And unfortunately, you know, we I don't think we took very many good swings today, and uh, it was kind of a battle of attrition. And uh, we, we were left standing here at the end. So it uh, certainly wasn't one of our better games, but. Uh, You know, after two, after uh, Wednesday at Bucknell, that was you know that was a battle, and you know the, the weather and the wind, and uh, I thought we, we pitched well and we got some timely hits. So, you know, it's uh, it's been difficult. It was nice that it was finally nice out here. I think we didn't know how to respond to that, but uh, all in all, you know, we'll come back tomorrow, and uh, hopefully uh, the two wins is going to put us in a rhythm where we can we can start. We talked about it after the game. Is, is we've just got to play with a little bit more. Uh, presence and a little bit more urgency to, to what we're doing here because uh, you know this is just one weekend in the process and, and again I mean we're all working towards that final goal of certainly making it to the tournament but also winning it and uh, we want to keep getting better game by game uh, within the process and today we kind of were in neutral so hopefully we come out tomorrow and uh, put it in drive and, and, and go back to what we've been doing uh, the best this year.